The iPhone and iPad's newest operating system is a little less than intuitive. Here are five quick iOS 10 tips that you might have missed. One, this one's designed for those of us who are experts at forgetting where we've parked our car. Do not call us forgetful. We just have more important things on our minds. If you have Apple's CarPlay system or if you pair your iOS device via Bluetooth, just open maps, tap on parked car, and you'll get directions. It will also give you directions to your home. And if you've forgotten where that is, then I think we can call you forgetful. Two, you love sending images via iMessage, but you're on a limited data plan. To save yourself and your message recipient some bytes, go to settings, messages, and scroll down to enable low quality image mode. Three, did you know you can reply directly to messages from your notifications? If your device has 3D touch, just do a hard press and then respond. If your device does not have 3D touch, just do a long press to open the program and the message or email. Four, you probably know that the app Find My iPhone will help you find your phone or your iPad. New with iOS 10, it will also help you find your Apple Watch. If you have an Apple Watch paired with your iPhone, you don't have to do anything. It will automatically add itself to the Find My iPhone app. Note to people trying to disappear, you might want to leave your phone and your watch behind so people can't stalk you. Number five, Apple showed this next tip off when they previewed iOS 10, but it's a bit hidden. First, type your message. Then long tap on the globe icon to bring up the list of installed keyboards. And then choose emoji. The words that can be emojified will turn red. Tap them to emojify them. If there's more than one choice, messages will give you all of your options. I am Megan Maroney. I host iOS Today every Monday and Tech News Today every Monday through Friday.